you know, and they're going to have to do something because nobody's getting away with this. Tonight, a letter sent to a First Coast family targeting their race, creating anger and frustration. That letter suggested the family who lives in Yuli moved to the uh, quote hood, their hood, as this person said, and take down graduation photos of their daughters outside their home. On your side's Robert Bradfield reports on the family's initial reaction and the responses they've received from strangers. These graduation photos of Toya Sprout's twin daughters are drawing hateful criticism. The family received this anonymous letter in their mailbox, in part reading, Your entire brood is a disgrace to the neighborhood. Consider moving to a hood of your kind. I did feel angry. I did want to fight. Naturally, it did not sit well with Sproul and her husband, but they say their daughters, Zaina and Zara, 2020 graduates of Yulee High School, did not let the letter get to them. You know, as a parent, you know, my next reaction is to protect my children. So I was instantly, you know, a little bit worried and concerned. And, and then we ultimately told them about it um, because I didn't want them to find out, you know, any other way. So we, we talked about it with them first and then we let them read the letter for themselves. The family is wanting to share a message of acceptance. They've lived in their neighborhood for five years and have not had any previous problems. They are getting letters and care packages from people in their own neighborhood and around the country. One letter arrived today from Wisconsin. We wish them success and happiness in all their endeavors. The Nassau County Sheriff's Office tells First Coast News this is out of character for Nassau County and we will continue to investigate this incident. The Sprouls want to find out who sent the letter, but more importantly, they want to share their gratitude to those who've reached out and supported their daughter's achievements. But I'm not going to give any, any life to that negativity because that's not who we are and that's not who anybody should be. We should be pushing love, practicing love. There will be a parade Thursday night in the Sprouls neighborhood to congratulate the daughters on their graduation. They will be attending St. Leo University outside Tampa on a full ride scholarship. Robert Bradfield, First Coast News on your side.